Um, anyone paying attention to the crypto industry and altcoins in the last few months will have noticed the incredible run that the Cospa native token Cos uh, went on. All was said and done. The token's price had risen over 70,000% from its all-time low of 0.0241699, which was recorded on June 1st. 2022, according to data from CoinMarketCap, um, uh, given that the cash token has risen so much, all eyes are now on the next coin that can replicate this growth. With thousands of altcoins in the space, it can be daunting to know which coins have the potential for such a rally. So in this report, we all know for some rally, uh, we fix with uh, the networks and networks. Uh, take a look at two altcoins that could potentially go the way of CAS and uh, secure massive gains uh, for uh, investors. Uh, uh, Jeek was one of the many altcoins that burst into the scene back in 2020 as the bull market took flight. In the same year, the token would hit a new all-time high. But perhaps the most alluring part of the project was the many utilities that followed suit. As X, formerly Twitter user Dexter, lists out, uh, Jack has a host of things that contribute to a bullish narrative. These include patented technology, its own payment service called PayPay, GEQ Data, the GEEQ chain, the Internet of Things, as well as IoT. Here's five times supply chain, real world assets, NSF, RWAs, therefore, uh, generational bottom for the GQ. Uh, uh, patented tech, uh, Jeep data, Jeep chain, Jeep pay by supply chain after IoT, secure data, uh, NFTs, there are RWAs, and so on. Uh, uh, L0 micropayment, smart contract, um, partnership with MNW is supply chain for hashtag supply chain, hashtag IoT, secure data, NFTs, or RWAs, etc. If eat the little today, we'll be making sure that this lockup in 2021 making sure that it's so proposal to privilege you box. And then the entire place says that the millionaires are made by the problem across the privileged dollars. Um, the project is currently in the test net phase, which is often been a bullish narrative for the likes of TASPA. When a main net arrives, it will make it a lot more effective in instance in all storms. And make it uh, that GEQ's market cap is currently uh, sitting at less than $5 million. Uh, which gives it a lot of runway to pull a run like Cass. Um, it's also listed an example probably most of us provides uh, available for multiple centralized and decentralized exchanges, including KuCoin, uh, Sendex, um, uh, and Uniswap, um, uh, among others. As ordinals became more of a fixture in the crypto market, multiple projects emerged that enjoyed the majority of the popularity. Some of these include the Ordi project that eventually scored a Binance listing and its price soared above $20, sending its market cap to $400 million. And however, others such as OXBT, where ordinals were right behind Ordi and have enjoyed a good level of success as well. OXBT's price rose as high as $70 before falling more than 99%. It still remains one of the largest ordinals tokens in the market. Um, for OXBT, which is currently sitting at just a $4.1 million market cap, uh, the bull narrative lies in the fact that ordinals could make a comeback. This is uh, not the first time that a narrative could be seen as over, but yet come back stronger. Even the ordinals have already proven this is possible. Uh, in such a case, then, uh, OHBT would be right behind Doherty and uh, a run up to a $400 million market cap would mean 100x and to go higher as the bull market rolls around. Performing similarly to CASPA. Uh, disclaimer. The following op-ed represents the views of the author and may not necessarily reflect the views of Bitcoinist. Bitcoinist is an advocate of creative and financial freedom alike.